7 Quick Ways to Treat Gnat Bites and Prevent Infection We've all had to deal with those annoying little insects buzzing around your face, flying into your eyes, and even diving into your open mouth from time to time. Gnats, or biting midges, are an annoyance when they circle you, and gnat bites can be the cause of a lot of pain and discomfort. They are worse during the midsummer, when the temperatures are hot and humid. At the beach, in the yard, in your house, at your barbecue, gnats have proven themselves to be a terrible nuisance. They like to fly around your face, land on your food, and some even bite. Gnats are a pain. Some will bite, while others suck blood and some just munch on your favorite plants. How do you treat gnat bites? Most of the time, you won't need specialized gnat bites treatment. However, if you experience unbearable pain and extreme itching, you can try the following natural remedies for the treatment of gnat bites. 1. Thoroughly wash the site of the bite. As with all insect bites, you want to wash the site thoroughly with soap and water to avoid ending up with a bacterial infection or worse Morgellons syndrome. Biting gnats have four razor-sharp blades in their mouth that tear your skin, which will leave a small open wound and leaving you susceptible to infection. Once you've thoroughly cleaned the bite, you will want to apply an antiseptic like hydrogen peroxide, iodine, or rubbing alcohol. 2. Apply apple cider vinegar. Vinegar is a popular natural home remedy that is used for a variety of purposes. When it comes to gnat bites, it can help to reduce pain, swelling, and redness. Soak a cotton ball with some vinegar and apply it gently to the area until it starts to feel better. 3. Apply a cold compress. If the gnat bite is brought on unbearable itching and swelling, you can find some relief by applying a cold compress to the side of the bite. Add some ice to a damp washcloth and place it over the bite. Allow the compress to sit over the affected area for at least 15 minutes. The cooling sensation will bring down the swelling and numb the skin to help alleviate the itching. Make sure that you don't apply the ice directly to the surface and don't leave the compress on for more than 20 minutes. 4. Use an anti-itch cream. Commercial, over-the-counter anti-itch creams, like Cortisin 10, contain hydrocortisone. Hydrocortisone is a chemical compound that will temporarily relieve the itching associated with insect bites. Many of the anti-itch creams on the market also include aloe, which will help to soothe and moisturize the skin. 5. Use essential oils. When it comes to treating insect bites, essential oils are a great tool. With just a few drops, you can quickly find relief from swelling and itching. Many of the essential oils that are recommended for using on bug bites will also to help prevent infection, which will help you to take a three-prong approach to treat your bites. They will even work for gnat bites on dogs. Best essential oils for insect bites, lavender, lemon balm, tea tree, chamomile, basil, thyme, peppermint, eucalyptus. It is important to remember that essential oils are extremely potent and should never be applied directly to the skin. Before using essential oil to treat a bug bite, you want to make sure you dilute it with a quality carrier oil, like coconut, jojoba, or almond oil. Along with being able to help in the treatment of gnat bites, many essential oils are also great for repelling gnats and is one of the best ways to repel mosquitoes and other annoying pests. 6. Try an aspirin paste. Aspirin is a treatment that will reduce the inflammation that is associated with gnat bites and may also aid in reducing the swelling and itching at the site. Use the back of a spoon to crush an aspirin and mix it with a small amount of water to form a paste. Rub the paste onto the bite and let stand for 10 minutes. 7. Take a cold shower. If you are dealing with multiple gnat bites, taking a cold shower for at least 10 minutes will help you feel better. The cold water will help to reduce the swelling and itching of the gnat and other insect bites. 